You are highly welcome to Think Money With Me. This video is going to show you how to create your first NFT on the Binance Smart Chain. I'm going to show you everything, every single details, everything I have done. And um, this is my first NFT. So you are going to learn from it just as you have not created your first NFT. After this video, you'll be able to create your first NFT and list them on the Binance chain. So for the preparation, make sure you have a Binance Smart Chain, that is BNB. So, and also make sure you have at least two followers in your Binance um, NFT profile. So, um, how do you start creating your NFT on Binance? Um, you need to go to Binance.com and sign and sign in. If, 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 you, if you have not created an account, make sure you create an account on Binance.com. Then sign up. After signing up, make sure you verify your account. And after verifying your account, that's the only time you will be able to create an NFT. So, um, this window you are seeing, how I got here is that I logged into my Binance.com. After logging in, you see this hamburger button here. You click on it. Sorry. Okay. Let me let me start this afresh so that everyone can follow it up. So type um, binance.com and log in. You do this in your browser. Don't do it in the app because some of the features are not available in the app. Okay. The create feature is not available in the app. So you, you only be able to create using your phone browser. Or your computer browser okay so this is the home page of the binance uh, app so once you sign in like myself i have signed in already so you click on this hamburger button here once you click on the hamburger button can you see nft down here all right click on it okay once you click on it and it opens, this is the uh, windows that you are going to see. This is the kind of environment you are going to see. You are going to see uh, recommended collections, uh, top collections and all of that. Recommended creators, featured NFTs, trending and so many of them. But we are not just interested in all, the, all of that. If you want to learn what NFTs are, you can also click here to go and learn. Also, I have made a video on that before on this channel. So I'm going to link that video in the description of this video so that you can get uh, more clues of what an NFT is in case you are a new person to the crypto world or to the NFT world. So once you open this window, what next you may want to do is to click on this profile to make sure that, um, to make sure that you are verified and also to make sure that you have up to two followers. You cannot be able to create an NFT if you don't have up to two followers. So as you can see, I, I now have only two followers as of the time of recording this video. And I'm following one of those person. So let me check who the second follower is so I can follow back. So let me follow back. Okay. I just followed back good so you can also share your um, profile link using this you can create your description you can edit about yourself and all that so but that should be a lesson for another day if you want to edit your information your username and everything do it using the app but if you want to create an nft you do it using the browser all right, for you to create your first NFT, you will need to um, click on this hamburger button here. Once you click on it, can you see create button? Click on create. Once you click on create, allow it to load. Then accept the terms and condition. Okay, so you see where it says create a new collection before minting NFT. First time minting on Binance NFT guide to nft minting so you can click on this guide for instructions okay so and you see this pop up 
So you need to create a new collection before minting NFT. So I have not minted my uh, an NFT before. This is my first NFT that I want to mint. So I will need to create a collection. All right. So um, it requires me to create a logo. The logo should be image and the banner should be image and the name and symbol and description okay let me first of all design my logo and design my banner image i recall the name i'm going to use for this uh, collection and the description i'm going to use so after that i'm going to come back and we continue with this video so remember um you need to have enough bnb in your spot wallet okay you need to not have enough bnb in your spot wallet so i also make sure i have enough bnb in my spot wallet all right now i have designed a new logo and i'm going to use the same logo as my banner so i just did it using canva so this is my new logo so i'm i'm gonna select it and allow it to upload uploaded okay so i'm still gonna use it as the banner let's see great so it looks more great here than the first one okay maybe this is because um the required uh size for this is 350 by 350 px but my own design is bigger looks like i'm gonna change this so let me create a new design so that it can fit in properly here okay i just created a new logo let's try and see how it's gonna look perfect all right so let's move on okay if you would like to uh, know how i created all this logo using a free to a free online tool called canva you can comment in the use the comment section and tell me so i can create a video and show you how i did it Okay, so I will now choose the, the, the name for this my collection and the name, I'm still going to use the same name, my love for Binance. Remember, you can always choose your own name. It must not be the same as mine, okay? So the name of my collection is my love for Binance. So I'm going to uh add things relating to binance into this collection let me just use an abbreviation m l f b yes okay so description this collection okay so um, this is gonna be in what category? So I'll leave my network in BSC. I'm gonna skip this for now. Collect a fee when a user resells an item you originally created. So I'm going to collect some fee, five percent sell fee. Yeah. So you add your Twitter handle, you add your Instagram. I, I don't remember my Instagram handle, so I add my Facebook, my Discord, okay, Telegram. So after all these things are set, I'm going to create my first collection. So I click on create okay no problem continue 
request successful, you will receive an email notification when the creation is complete. Following notification, you can create NFTs under this collection. So I'll have to wait to receive the approval of my color co collection. As you can see, it is in review. So once the system reviews this and approves it, I'm going to receive an email and after then I can create my first NFT. So let's just wait. Good news, my NFT collection is created. You have successfully created an NFT collection, my love for Binance. So I'm ready to mint. <laughs> All right, so let's go back and I'm going to refresh this. You click here and click on create. All right, so create an NFT. Remember, the first thing we did was creating our collection because that was the first time we are creating an NFT. So after creating your collection, you are now going to import, you are now going to create an NFT. So your NFT can be an image, a video, or an audio. So, and these are the five types supported, G, JPG, PNG, GIF, SVG, MP3, WAV, MP4, and the maximum size should be 50 MB. So you type in the title, you type in the description and all of that. Wow, minting completed. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, so they didn't want me to mint my NFT because it contained Binance logo, and right now I decided um, to use a uh, I decided to use my picture and just an audio file okay so I can list this NFT right now so the next thing to do is just to list the NFT okay so I'm going to list this NFT and um, all this is just for fun okay so I'm going to place the price to be for the highest bidder and the price should start from uh, 50 BMB to 100 BMB. <laughs> <laughs> at the current market price, uh, 1 BMB is at uh, $316 and uh, if you check $316 times uh, 50, that's fifteen thousand eight hundred dollars, and if it's hundred BMB, that's that one thousand six hundred dollars. So I'm looking for someone to buy this piece of music for fifteen thousand eight hundred dollars to um from fifteen thousand eight hundred dollars to that one thousand six hundred. Okay, let me in fact let me do it um one fifty BMB. Let's see. So Binance is going to take 1%. Okay, Binance is going to take 1%. If it is 5% less than the minimum markup, the bid cannot be made. 
I think that is what it means. So, expiration date is uh, 8.13. Today is what? Today is 10th. Let me, let me make it to be... So let's see who's gonna buy this nft for 50 bmb or 150 bmb within the next seven days <laughs> so i'll go ahead and list okay correct all right i'll submit list details minimum bid 50 bmb buy buyout price 150 bmb Total price. Um, total price is fifty BMB. Fee six percent. Wow, I thought it's one percent, so confirm. listing completed this item is part of the standard collection therefore the transaction proceeds from the initial sale of this item will be subject to a 10-day clearing period okay so my nft is already listed so i can share it can share it to my Twitter account. So I just made my tweet. So you can follow the process and do yours. <laughs>